downtown Richmond lot into the nation's first clean energy park have now been scrapped. Dominion Energy is saying it will no longer be developing the park, but instead plans to use that money for other clean energy programs. 8 News anchor Heather Hope joining us live in studio now with more on what's next for that space. Heather. Air Dominion Energy sent a memo to its staff this week saying plans to develop its Canal Street property into a regional clean energy park are no more. The city of Richmond confirmed that Dominion sent them a request yesterday to withdraw from its park development proposal. Last October, Dominion Energy announced this initiative to bring the first publicly available level three fast chargers that could fully charge vehicles in 10 to 15 minutes. The park space would also have solar power, urban wind turbines, and an area for food trucks and community use. The Dominion Energy staff memo says plans to develop the 700 East Canal Street property next to its headquarters are canceled since the company has announced other plans to start a top to bottom business review. The memo says this helps its shareholders value and the sustainability and long term scope of decarbonization programs. The memo went on to say the company is committed to becoming the most sustainable energy company in America and it plans to use the capital saved from the park for other clean energy programs for customers and the community. Just last year, the city assessed the Canal Street lot to be worth $10 million. Dominion Energy says it expects to launch the sale process in the coming weeks. The company has already placed its Grayland Avenue and 8th and main properties for sale and has sold or is selling unused property at Innsbruck. Deanna.